everyone, Gadget Girl Kylie here, and welcome back to another live stream let's play episode of Tokyo Xanadu. Hopefully, fingers crossed, we get some combat on this episode, which of course we will do because we are in a dungeon. Yes, action episode. The first episode was very much just kind of setting up the world, meeting characters, and you know, some story about the game. We did get a little bit of combat, but hopefully. Hopefully, we're going to get the meat, the meat of the sandwich today, so I'm super excited. Anyway, thank you so much for all the love and support on episode one so far, guys. Uh, bear in mind, support on a series is really, really important, so likes, comments, favourites, shares, watch time, and of course donations. Uh, there's only so many hours in the day, so I can't do every single game on the channel. So I do look at these things when deciding if I should continue a series. But anyway, let's go ahead and jump in to this dungeon. If you missed part one, it is up on my YouTube channel and it's also archived on Twitch as well. So it's up to you where you want to watch. You can now switch partners. Okay, triangle button to change partner. Press right on the D-pad in the camp menu to change the order of your party. Nah, I don't need that. So, double jump, circle, circle. Let's have a look at her moveset. That's nice. That's nice. Let's go with uh, Asuka. Renoa says, good evening everyone, just popping in to leave a like. Thank you so much, Renoa. Oh, nice. We got an elemental kill there. So the game hasn't told me what the elements are yet. R1 is dodge. But uh, I know one of my viewers, Arjuna, if you're watching, did actually message me about elements, but I didn't have time to read it. I'm sorry. <laughs> I just kind of saw that you sent me a DM on Twitter and I didn't read it because it was dead late when I got it, so... And I forgot to read it today. <laughs> I'm sure the game will tell us about elements in a little bit. I'm hoping for a boss fight, guys. That's what I want. Give me the boss, baby! What the heck are they? Bird slugs. So we've got turnip demons so far, and now we've got bird slugs. <laughs> okay, so they're wind elements. Tosk says, One tip, Kylie, destroy everything you see. Right, so fire, wind, steel, spirit, and shadow. Cool. No mercy, says Ernest. <laughs> Kill everything. So fire is strong against wind. Where's the Pokemon logic? <laughs> Parasite says, Kylie is playing as the lead waifu. Does the camera pan down enough to check their underwear like in SAO? I don't know, I haven't tried yet. But you've planted the seed in my head now, Parasite. I'm gonna have to see if we can get a sneaky flash of underwear. <laughs> Okay, there are five different elements assigned to allies and enemies. Hopefully we can recap on this. So fire is strong against wind. Wind is strong against spirit. And spirit is strong against... What? SP. SP... Oh, there we go. Never mind. I was looking at it wrong. So fire is strong against wind. Wind is strong against steel, spirit is... Steel is strong against spirit, and... 
Yeah, okay. Uh, this is not gonna sink in at all. Like, this is just gonna be a learning process from playing, I think. Hocking onto a target by tapping the L shoulder button lets you see their elemental weakness. Oh, okay. Cool. If a F character attacks, increase damage. Right, okay. Nice. Oh, I won't. I may be a little bit forgetful, but I'm not that forgetful, okay? Give me some credit. About kill bonuses. Eating certain conditions when defeating an enemy will earn a kill bonus that gives bonuses such as rare item drops. Defeat foes by exploiting their elemental weakness to get an elemental kill. Elemental kills will affect your stage evaluation, so go for them whenever possible. Okay. So elemental kill, defeat an enemy with its elemental weakness, fatal kill, finish off enemy by dealing more than half its HP, chain kill, defeat two or more enemies simultaneously, Aerial kill, defeat enemy with aerial attack, aerial power attack, or flying skill. The battle page entry is now available in the Nyar. Once you defeat an enemy, its information is available in the battle note. Okay, cool, so then it tells you what their uh, weakness is. That's good. Get wrecked, son. Zachariah says, this game looks really good, so I'm going to be ordering sometime soon. Hang on. In the next day or two, but then I will I probably won't be able to watch your stream anymore as to avoid spoilers. That's fair enough. That's fair enough. You can always watch later. Nice. I'm getting hit quite a bit actually. <laughs> I need to dodge, maybe be a bit more cautious than what I'm being now. Parasite says Kylie just ignore the names of the elements, just memorise the colours instead. So yellow, with yellow thrown in there, so red fire is strong against green grass and blue water is strong against fire. I'll try and remember. Oh, what is that? That is a pig man. <laughs> what the hell? Yeah, exactly. <laughs> what the hell, man? It's an orc. Look at its nipples! We've found the nipples! <laughs> we were always looking for the nipples. In games. Never say no to nips. You can now use range skills. <laughs> Press the square button while standing. Perform long range attacks. The strength greatly depends on magic, magic attack. Works well against enemies with low magic defense. Welcome to the stream, Stevie. I 
Dommy Gamer says that orc sure is ugly, yes. <laughs> Ian C Golding says, so anime dudes don't get nips, but monsters do. Yeah, that seems to be the way it works. Monster nips aren't sexual. <laughs> That's what it is. <laughs> Faye Merif says, did the orcs from Tokyo Xanadu steal all the nipples from visual novels? <laughs> About skill point recovery. <clears throat> skill points are consumed when using a character's special skill. Skill points will regenerate over time. Regeneration speed will increase when landing normal attacks, so be sure to switch between regular attacks and skills. Balance is key. Okay, the skill points you use up recover over a period of time, so it's at the bottom of the screen. Every basic attack you land increases the recovery rate. Fair enough. About breakable objects. Within an eclipse, you will run across boxes and other breakable objects that can be smashed to reveal orbs or items. As with kill bonuses, smashing stuff will affect your stage evaluation, so be sure to embrace your inner vandal and destroy everything. Oh yes. I'm ready to destroy. I was born ready. Come on, bring it on. Okay, destroy the boxes to obtain orbs and items. Life orbs heals H HP, potions or eclipse ingredients may appear. You can now access the help topics on parameters and status changes. For more information, check out the Niar help page. Ah, uh, Parasite, that shows how long you've been supporting my channel that you remember Praise Jibs. Praise Jibs. That was created from playing uh, Monster Hunter on Twitch, wasn't it? Open sesame! くそ。なんだってこんな仕掛けが。こっちは急いでるってのに。焦らないで、時差くん。え、迅速に確実に先へ進みましょう。シュート。Get wrecked, son. Ah, oh, yeah. <laughs> Ian Golding says those tutorials are the reason why everyone thinks video games make us violent. <laughs> Get wrecked! Oh yeah, I'm getting used to combat now, guys, I think. Parasite says yes, it is from the early Twitch days. Back in the day on Twitch. When I was Lord Jibs. <laughs> oh no! Stairs. Oh, that was nice. I'm getting better at combat, guys, I feel. I don't want to get too cocky, though. Mikey says, I'm not a violent person outside of video games. Yeah, yeah, Mikey. You're you're a vandal. You're, you're, you're a fug. That fug life, though. Ah! I'm probably not going to get a good rank on this. Because I am getting hit quite a bit. Thank you so much for the 46 likes, guys. Keep it coming. 
it shows me you like what you see, it shows me that you want more, and it means I will make more content. Likes, comments, views, watch time, donations, it all shows me you're having a great time. Yes, get to that. Level up! Nice! Oh yeah! Ka-ching! Ka-ching! Do I have to make it through that door within so long? Ian Golding says, are there no healing skills yet? Not at the moment, it seems. Patience. Patience, Ian. I'm sure we will get some eventually. Just not yet. Mikey says there's healing items inside some of the boxes so far. Ah, okay. Oh, I got greedy! I got greedy and I got hit! That's what happens when you get greedy. Yes! An item from the real world has disappeared. What? Flowery tunic obtained? Yeah! We're gonna be styling in this flowery tunic, guys. <laughs> we're gonna be looking fabulous in the floral wear. Can I equip that now? Oh, it's for her. So her ranged... Actually, everything goes up. Let's do it. Yes, please. Does it look different? Looks the same. So their outfits stay the same. They just get different equipment. It's a blue walk with more nips. I've got a bad feeling about this. I'm blue, dabba dee dabba die. I'm a nook and I'm gonna die. Oh god, it's like super powerful. I can't stop looking at the nips. <laughs> Sensor, there is nips. <laughs> Defeat it and the barrier will fall. Right, so I don't think anyone's super effective against it. Yeah! That was awesome! 
like a boss! About gift cubes. Defeating an S tier greed while exploring may cause a gift cube to appear. By smashing one, you can obtain the rare materials possessed by the defeated S greed. Gift cubes appear once the S greed in a dungeon is defeated. May contain rare items. Sweet, I'll have me some of that. Give me the rare giblets. Lord Jibs commands that there are giblets. Oh yeah! Cool. Can I equip any of that or not? No. It went by so fast I didn't actually get to properly see what it was. <laughs> Give me a boss fight. That's what I want. That's what I want, game. Give it to me. Rank A? Ooh, that was actually higher than I was expecting, guys. I wasn't expecting a rank A. Maybe it's just more forgiving because it is like the first dungeon that we've been in. <laughs> Let, let's not get ahead of ourselves here, Kylie. About stage scores. Once you clear a dungeon, you will be graded on your efforts. Clear time, damage ratio, greed defeated and treasures found all factor into your final grade. Ah, oh, that's too much empire. I can't take all that in. Okay. Yeah, I don't need to read it. Basically, as do as much as possible in as little time as possible, and take as little damage as possible, and you will get a high grade. <laughs> Zen Kitty says, "Kylie, looking fine as usual. Thank you, Zen Kitty. You flirt, you." Sun Phoenix says, have a good stream, about to clock in at work. Ah, oh, have a good day, Sun Phoenix. See you later in the comment section. Does the clock freeze on talking? Ratatosk, do you know? Because Ratatosk is saying, you did good in this dungeon, but it was the time, time you took that killed your S rank. I'm not really one for getting like top marks anyway, like I'm not dead competitive, I'm not that kind of person. I just get excited when it happens, <laughs> I'll accept it as it comes. But uh, yeah, my question is, does the timer still count even when like we're on bits like this where there's talking? Because I'm looking over at my chat and interacting with everyone so, <laughs> you know, it is going to add time on. Oh sweet, so we can stock up on items, nice. Science! Magic! Willpower! <laughs> Teenage angst! About relics. Deep within a dungeon will be a golden relic that will heal your HP when activated. Use relics to make purchases as well as save your progress in a dungeon. Okay, relics are located at key points on the stage, recover HP upon contact, save inside dungeons, change party, purchase, mix elements, power up, skill grid. Green relics do the same except will not recover HP. Okay, so let's go ahead and... Uh... Shop. What can we buy? We have got some potions. 250 HP, 1000 HP.
Right, that'll do for now. And let's save as well. Let's have a snooze, sneaky save. Ratatosk says, Yup, time stops on scripted conversations like this one. And the chat moved. Every time I want to read a comment. Uh, but now that you have the grade, the rest is not changing anything. Ah, okay. Zen Kitty says, This game reminds me of SAO, especially the characters. A female named Asuka with blonde hair and a rapier. Whoa. It's funny you should say that. We were all talking about this on episode one. That Asuka is Asuna. <laughs> right, this is gonna be a boss fight. Let's take a slurp. Let's get ready. Now that my whistle is wet, let's take on the boss. Sexiness. There's too many hot women in this. There's too many hot men. Too many husbandos and waifus. I never thought I'd see the day. <laughs> Zen Kitty says it's Asuna in disguise. Not a very good disguise, though. Hello, Koffer Aesthetic. Welcome to the stream! I've been seeing you in the comment section of my videos as well, so thank you so much for supporting me. Nice to see you in the live stream, that's awesome. Boss fight hype, says Dommy Gamer. Yes. Give me a big boss with nipples. It's gotta have nips. Come on. Where's the nips? No, there's no nips! But he does have rippling muscles. Menace Ogre. Lots of eyes as well. Aye aye. You can't fight. <laughs> fight dancing. Are we gonna fight or we're we gonna dance, brah? Right, let's be careful. Has the game even told me how to use items in battle yet? <laughs> Dave Doggy, or Dog, I don't know how you actually say your last name. Big Bambi eyes, check. Slender frame, check. A stylish emo and hipster haircut, check. Ludicrous plot lines, check. Hammy dialogue, check. So how much does this game cost? It costs £40 UK money and I think $40 American money, but I don't know about other other areas. <laughs> it's challenging me to a dance off. Yes, it is. <laughs> Hellspire says too many eyes on that thing. Let's just poke it in the eye. The eye's gonna be the weak spot, right? Or all the Monster balls? Does it have balls? It just has a pointy area. <laughs> I, don't, I don't know whether that's its uh, manhood, but uh, yeah. Hit it till it's dead, says Ryan. Let's go, Hiragi! Oh my god, really? Oh, hit me!
Come at me, you ugly bugger! Come at me, bro! Oh, hello. Okay, activate X strike by holding L and pressing R. Once you have enough strike points, allows you to lock on to multiple enemies and deal big damage at once. Okay, so hold L and then press R. Oh, here we go! Oh! Oh, epicness! Yeah, take it! Deal that damage though. Yeah! Give the stream a like. We killed him. Mr. Eyeballs is dead. Awesome. Awesome. That was so cool. Oof. I like the combat actually. <laughs> Ryan says, use your S craft, I mean X Strike. <laughs> Trails of Cold Steel reference. Victory! <laughs> Renoa says, ooh, this animation is nice. Thank you so much for the 70 likes on YouTube, guys. Keep it coming, keep it coming. Let's smash that 100 like goal live on this stream. Show me you want more of this game. We can do it. I believe in Team GGK. JJ M. Ara says, too bad I don't have a PS Vita. Don't worry, it is coming to the PS4 at a later date with added bonuses. Look at her, she's like, yeah. <laughs> Cocky. Dave Doggy says, wow, is this the Vita? It looks so good. It is. But I'm playing on the PlayStation TV and I'm viewing and streaming it in 720p. You can get the uh, PlayStation TV really, really cheap now, actually. So 
Could be worth checking out. Bear in mind there are some beta games that don't work on the PlayStation TV though. Hello Simon, welcome to the stream! She likes where your hand is, Ko. <laughs> Just move it down a little bit. <laughs> Touch my boobs! Faye Merif says, I love the expression Asuka had. Ko has just returned from fighting for his life and she was like, yeah, this is just a normal night for me. Because <laughs> she's a badass. Zachariah says, it's so annoying that almost every game on the Vita gets an improved PS4 version. It's like they're not even trying to keep the Vita alive. Well, at least the PS4 version of this game comes out later on, so it's not like a dual release of both versions, so... And I think the PS4 version does have extras as well. At the end of the day, the Vita is dying. There's a, there's a distinction here, okay? The Vita is dying, but the Vita is not dead. There are still games coming out for it, fantastic games like this, plenty of other games due out as well, uh, also games that get funded on Kickstarter, so it's not dead, but it is dying. You know, as a Vita fan, I'm able to accept that it is dying, it's had a good run, I've thoroughly enjoyed the Vita, there's amazing games on the Vita, heck, I've covered so many Vita games on the channel, I'm a huge advocate of the Vita, but at the end of the day, it is dying. So, it kind of makes sense that if they want to continue a franchise or a game series or whatever it may be to make a PS4 version as well to try and keep the fans or get new fans so that they can continue on the PS4. So I can see it from a business point of view basically. Exactly. Electric Tiger says, I want to see Freedom Wars on the PS4. 100% agree with you, Tiger. 100%. At the end of the day, I love it on the PS Vita, but I'd rather see the series continue or like at the very least a remaster brought to the PS4 and then a Freedom Wars 2 coming out later. It would be amazing. I would also love Soul Sacrifice Delta as well. Love, love, love Soul Sacrifice Delta. So many other Vita games as well. So. I'm all for it if it means that the series continues or you get a sequel. Arjuna says, still waiting for my Mary Skelter. I'm interested in that game. Chapter 1 complete, guys. Where's my trophy? Where's my trophy? Come on, dingling for me. Give me my trophy. Zachariah says, you are absolutely right. It is dying, but it's not dead. But it may officially die once Sony releases the new console that they have in the works. Save. Oh, there it is. Ah, I just had to press X. <laughs> it was my own fault, guys. Parasite159 says the Vita is still very strong in Japan due to the preference of portable gaming, but the Western market is diminishing. Yep. I really want a um, blue PS Vita Slim because they're so nice, the blue. This is exactly like Trails of Cold Steel, this bit. <laughs> so many things from Trails of Cold Steel. Faye Merif says, I'd buy Freedom Wars on the PS4. The platform is what's preventing me from getting Freedom Wars. There were a lot of rumours going around that Sony is going to make a Vita 2, but uh, 
<laughs> I just think this is wishful thinking from the Vita fans. 5.30 in the morning? Nope, going back to bed. Blaze Felix says there's a lot of Vita slash PS4 games in Japan not being brought here on the Vita I noticed. Well, the good thing about the PS Vita and the PS4 being region free is you do have the option to get these games. Literally, like, I keep telling people, I know memory cards are expensive, but if you do want the chance to play uh, Vita games from different regions, I do recommend getting another memory card to have a separate PSN account of a different region on that memory card, because on the PS Vita and the PlayStation TV, it literally takes, like, less than a minute to switch accounts. Honestly, on the PlayStation TV, it's easier than the PS Vita. It probably takes me about 40 seconds to switch between my American and my US. UK account on my PlayStation TV so I do highly recommend it just so you can expand your library uh, you know and it gives you the option to go digital and get different games from different regions <laughs> Dave Doggy says he sleeps in his shirt and pants the dirty so-and-so we commented on this on part one. Does he not have PJs? Feymerif says, it might be in Sony's best interest to make a new handheld. The handheld market is still huge. Who knows, they might do. They might do, seeing the success of the Nintendo Switch. It might kind of spur spur that on in them but um i'll believe it when i see it i don't want to get my hopes up i would love a vita 2 a vita 2 that plays all of the ps vita games and then vita 2 games as well that would be amazing I forgot to eat breakfast. Breakfast is the most important meal of the day. Nautico. It sets you up. It gives you energy. Gets you ready. Plus, we're going to be fighting demons. Turnip demons. Bird slugs. Nipple orcs. <laughs> the lot. <laughs> we need to be ready. <laughs> Flaco Chavez says, I miss my PS Vita. Why? Where did it go? You didn't sell it, did you? Madness. Never sell your Vita. I still have my Vita fat. My uh, modded PS Vita. My red Japanese PS Vita. It's lovely. So many people panicking about the sellotape on it in that video that I did. It's like, chill out guys. It's fine. I just have to sellotape the connection so that I can record directly from the screen. It's fine, there's no scratches on it, it's immaculate, it's my baby, I take care of it, it's all good. <laughs> Parasite says, no Kylie, dessert is the most important meal of the day. Okay, you've got me on that one, Parasite. <laughs> I cannot go out for a family meal or any kind of meal without wanting dessert. I love my dessert. JM Kingy says nipple orcs are the most dangerous of all the orcs. That's where they get their power from. Power resonates from the nips. <laughs> power nips. <laughs> 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 
It's the um, tomboy, isn't it? We had a level up as well, so I wonder if we get to allocate some stats. Great form! Look at her! She's a badass! Damn, don't want to mess with her. Your defense is weak, drive more with your hips. I, that's not something I want to hear from an old guy talking to a young lady. Drive from your hips. No, you're okay. You need to put more strength into your core again. <laughs> Zen Kitty says, one look at those nips and you're dead. <laughs> Hypnotic nips. Let's hope this video doesn't get demonetized. <laughs> Sleemark says, I've sort of moved away from handhelds over the years. I like PC more these days, so I'm glad a lot of Japanese games are getting ported over. Yeah, that's a point actually. It's nice to see these games coming onto Steam. I'm not really a PC gamer, I much prefer consoles, I always have and probably always will. Even though I have a beastie PC um, and I do have a Steam account, I don't really play PC games. <laughs> oh, excuse me, I'm so sorry. <laughs> JM Kingy says, drive more with your hips, sounds like a Friday night. Dave Doggy says, that's so inappropriate in the dirty old man dojo. <laughs> oh, so you've finally come. Not for you. Hellsfire says the power nip thing is reminding me of a season one from an from, a, from an anime that I watched. A girl in a swimsuit making an energy blast from her chest. <laughs> Thank you everyone for saying bless you. I appreciate it. JM Kingy says, Kylie, one, bless you, thank you. And two, did you ever play Eternal Sonata? Loved that game so much. I played it on the PlayStation 3, but my file got corrupted, so I couldn't finish it. I started it um, again on the Xbox 360, I think, and yeah, I didn't finish it either, sadly. But I loved it though, what I played of it, it was so delightful. From what I've heard, you've been busier than ever with various jobs. Jobs, in quotations. <laughs> I mean, to be fair, the old guy's got epic facial hair game. It's like perfectly trimmed. Perfect trim. I like it. That sounds wrong. Let's not say that again. Ooh! Dojo outfit. <laughs> Sleemox says, LOL, that's what I was thinking. Why is Rolf Harris running a dojo? <laughs> Hmm, that's why you need to hurry up and get changed. 
JM Kingy says, What kind of jobs does this old guy mean? Stranger, danger. He's creepy. Not only do you never come by to say hello, you've been working without your school's permission. It appears that I have much to teach you, yes? So you need permission from your school to get a part-time job. <laughs> I suppose in a way that's good because it means they're making sure that you're not overworked and you're not stressed and coming to school all tired and you're not able to absorb the learning. Um, uh, Riza says, is this a multi-stream on Twitch as well? Yes, it is. I'm streaming on YouTube and Twitch and I can read and interact with both chats at the same time. I noticed that she's talking but the mouth is not moving. I'm just checking on Twitch now. Yeah, there we go. It looked like it had frozen for a second, but it's alright. Is everyone... Is it okay for everyone watching on Twitch? Speak up and let me know. It looked like it froze for me there, but... Uh, seems alright now. JM Kingy says, Kylie, kick the creepy dojo guy's ass. I feel bad beating up an old man. <laughs> you tricked me. Thank you, Suxus. See you later in the comments section. Yep, she's not wrong. <laughs> hey, Devoid Dude, welcome to the stream. <laughs> JM Kingy says she has anime mum hair. She is the first to die. <laughs> I've seen that Twitter uh, Twitter post circulating around. I know what you're talking about. What chapter is this, says Devoid Dude. Uh, we just finished chapter one, so I think this is kind of like in between uh, from chapter one to chapter two. It hasn't officially said chapter two yet, but we could be in chapter two, I don't know. I just know we've finished chapter one. Oh, beloved grandson, give up. It's time for you to pay up, as it were. And I believe this is a good opportunity to straighten you out some. There's no escape now. Grandpappy's got his hand on your shoulder. Shadic Team says, this is in the PS Vita. Yes, this is the PlayStation Vita version. I'm playing it on the PlayStation TV. Right, I'm skipping that because it's going to have copyright. I think that plays in between every chapter then. Chapter 2, Mysteries. <laughs> Sleemox says, stop touching kids, Rolf. To the lady's fancy teacher. Nah, yeah, he's alright. He's a bit plain. Not my cup of tea. 
Not husbando. Not husbando. Sorry, not doing it for me. Nope, nope, nope. Thank you so much for the 81 likes, guys. We can do it. We can smash that 100 like goal. I know we can. It shows me you're enjoying the stream, you're enjoying the game, and you want more. Likes, comments, views, shares, donations are all proves to me that you want more of this game and you're having a great time. So make sure you're clicking the thumbs up button. It really supports. Dave Doggy says, where do you have to skip FMV scenes these days to avoid copyright? In particular, Japanese music is really bad for copyright, so I've just learned over the years to just never include it in my videos. If my wish comes true, I want to become a bad. Oh my god, she sounds adorable speaking in English. Even if I lose everything else. Someday, I want to go to the place of memories with him. Oh, kawaii! Moshi negai ga kanau nara, watashi wa ichiwa no tori ni naritai. Hoka no subete o nakushite mo, itsu ka kare to no omoide ga nemuru ano basho e. I learned German in school. I did do a little bit of French. Um. Because we got to kind of do a little bit of French, Spanish, and German, and then we had to pick which one we wanted to go into, and I chose German. I couldn't remember it now, like. <laughs> Perfect. I can't remember most of the stuff I learned in school. It kind of feels so irrelevant later in life now. <laughs> if you gave me a test paper for like maths or something, I bet you I'd fail miserably. I couldn't remember like. 90% of the stuff I learned. Just what I expect from a student who's lived abroad. Your pronunciation is wonderful. <laughs> what is she saying, says Blaze Felix. Well, she read it out in English first, and then she probably read out the same thing in Japanese. So, it was the same thing. That's what I assumed from that scene, anyway. Lucas says, that's what I wanted to ask you if you still remember German. Oh, I don't want to say something and then insult you. <laughs> and probably my... Uh, Pronunciation is bad on it. So <laughs> <laughs> You're going to get called on if you keep doing that. Mr. Goro sure is popular. <laughs> I was about to say it's literally because he's jealous. Because all the ladies are like swooning over him. そこでいかにも答えたそうにしている。いぶき立ってくれ。おお、ソンワーブユドン。お、俺。You've I remember, actually, it's funny because my German teacher, uh, a lot of the girls fancied him and they, they would always do this thing where he would ask a question 
and they'd put their hands up and stand up to answer it and then they'd just be like, oh, I forgot, hee <laughs> hee, you know, like, just be really derpy and stupid. And then they'd sit down and he'd just laugh it off because he knew that they all fancied him. It was so, so cringe. Really cringe. Oh, what? Why me? What is life? I wasn't paying attention. Do I actually have to pick an answer? <laughs> Ernest says, I hate being called in class when I was back in school. An unforgettable, an unforgettable journey. What work also follows an unforgettable journey through Hemeric, Greece. The call of Ch Chitula? I can't even say that. The Odyssey, Catch-22. I wasn't paying attention. Guys, what's the answer? Thank God for live streams. <laughs> I'm guessing if we get the correct answers, like, I can't remember what it does in Trails of Cold Steel, but I know that you want to be getting the correct answers so i'm gonna wait for the chat to catch up and i'm gonna pour myself more liquid the second one says arjuna the odyssey Okay, everyone, well, most people seem to be voting for the Odyssey, so I'm going to go ahead and choose that. <laughs> Correct! Well done, chat! Well done! Congratulations! You are awesome! <laughs> oh god, he's getting cocky now. He's probably going to get asked another question. Thanks to me! Well, thanks to you guys. Ratatosk. <laughs> <laughs> Ratatosk says, getting the correct choice increases your wisdom. Ooh, that's nice. Thank you for letting me know, Ratatosk. それさえあれば、自然と身につい <laughs> he winked and he got the stars. That's awesome. The girl's like, yes, senpai, I'll do whatever you say. Swoon. Kya! <laughs> oh my god, he's just been won over. Yoto is 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 getting the, the man the man love right now. That's fine. I'm all for it. Ryoto and Senpai. I ship it. Arjuna says, wait till you see Shio, Kylie. Maybe you'll like him. Ooh. Arjuna, you know me, so if I don't like him, shame on you. <laughs> well, I've, I think you know my taste by now, so... I've got a good feeling. I've got a good feeling. Ko's wisdom increased. Regarding wisdom, courage, and virtue, I want to be the most virtuous. Ko has the special parameters of wisdom, courage, and virtue. These parameters are the teachings of Ko's grandfather, Suzuki. Hopefully I said that correctly. I'm just going off the way it's said in Naruto. And can be trained through various daily actions. Read books and make story decisions to raise this. The higher the dungeon clear rank, the greater the increase raised by completing quests on Niar. If your rank goes up, speak to Suzuki for your reward. It 
If the appropriate choice is selected during an event, Ko's wisdom can go up just like before. Okay. Lunch break. So we need to go and read some books, guys. Get educated, man. He's a player. <laughs> Ryota's fallen in love with him. Oh, how dare he use his manly wiles on me. <laughs> Oh my god, maybe that's why he was pretending he didn't like him, because secretly he wanted his D. It's pronounced like Sosuke. Sosuke, there we go. I'll never be that cool. Ernest says I hate reading books. I haven't read a book in a while. I've been reading manga, actually. I've started collecting one of the Monster Hunter mangas. Um, I don't know how to pronounce it. It's not the Flash Hunter, it's the other one. Monster Hunter Aragi, is it? I don't know if I've said that correctly. I can't get the fourth and final book. It's out of print and I don't know where to read it in English. Ah, <sighs> who cares? The Void Dude says, will you be streaming for much longer, GGK? I'm going to make a cup of tea. Uh, yeah, I'm going to be streaming. It's only 20 to 10. I can stream until 11, so I don't know if I'm going to stream all the way till 11 because my throat is starting to feel sore again. But uh, I'll be streaming for a while longer. I got forced to join Gramps morning training. It lasted all the way until school started. <laughs> She's sneaky. She's sassy and sneaky. I like it. JM Kingy says, I can imagine if Kylie had a child, it would have one hell of a Japanese name. It probably would, but considering I don't want children, never have, never will, it won't happen. <laughs> I've always liked the name Sakura, though. And I like the name that I created for my roleplay characters back in the day. A lovely lady called Raymeria. I actually use that name for Monster Hunter quite a bit. She's that freshman the karate club's all excited about, right? I can't tell if that fits on the screen without my uh, face cam blocking it, so I'm just reading it out just in case. Anything in the upper right hand corner, I'm kind of just reading out just in case. Yes, as the senior students at the dojo, it's your job. I think any girl fancies Ko. It's nothing. It's been 10 days since it happened. Feels like the memory's already fading.
Ryan says, Yup, I'm so hyped for Cold Steel 3. Nice. So, so, so close to the 100 like goal, guys. Don't forget to click the thumbs up button. Show me that you like this game. Show me that you want more. Likes, views, comments, donations, it all shows me that you like it. That you like it. <laughs> Arjuna says you can buy books, Kylie, from Booker Ryan. The books there will increase your stats. Okay, thank you, Arjuna. Before that, though. Is it happening to... Oh no, it's just happening to uh, Shiori. It's like the men in black. <laughs> just look over here. <laughs> Unfortunately. <laughs> Why would she want to erase Ko's memories though? The fact that he's a wielder means that he can help her. Or is she that cocky that she thinks she can just take care of everything on her own? It's like, damn girl, just accept a man's help. I need saving by no man. I'm a real woman. And I suppose explaining things to you will help keep your mouth shut. Mr. N3LZ says she's an independent woman. She don't need no man. That's true. この世界が何十年も前から歴史の裏側で関わり続けてきたものよ。あなたも目にしたゲートという特異点。それを起点にグリードがいる迷宮がこの世界に重なり、様々な形で侵食する。それがイクリプスと呼ばれる現象よ。Just nails is fine, Kylie. Okay. Awesome. それは様々な。Is anyone else having quality issues? Because for me on the preview window, it's perfectly fine. Amy, if if you can't mod, it's fine. Just let your partner know. I know that you're on holiday and uh, you didn't know if you were going to have good internet, so it's all good. あるいは階段や都市伝説などの形で処理されるわね。そしてそんな異界を監視する組織が。Down 
結社ネメシス Ryan says I'm good here. It must just be certain people having problems with buffering because my streaming window is perfectly fine. Nemesis. Stars. The ones who fly on dark wings sworn to uphold the eye of truth. That's the group I belong to. <laughs> Yeah, <laughs> it's like something out of a video game. <laughs> JM Kingy says, I don't know why they look like twins, but it bugs me that a lot of games will make their protagonists look similar or like twins of Asuna and Kirito. I feel like there's quite a few characters that look like SAO characters in this game already. <laughs><笑> あ、<笑> Mara says generic anime protagonist trademarked. <laughs> was it just a dream? No, it was real. We leveled up. How can you forget that? Mr. Musly Many Eyes Monster. Afternoon classes ended, the students began heading home. Another part-time job awaited Ko, so he said goodbye to Shiori and the others. How many jobs does Ko have? Seriously? When does he sleep? That's why he's tired all the time. He's always working. JM Kingy says, I have nothing against the characters themselves. They probably have more depth than SAO, but their designs just seem to look like a lazy copy paste. Maybe it's just me. Hang on a second. There's a new comment from someone new in the chat. Welcome, Vperus69. I'm so sorry, I tried. It's because that piece of garbage manga anime SAO is really popular for some reason, so some games developers are trying to uh, get fans of SAO to play their games, basically. I love SAO! Get out! <laughs> I'm only joking. You're entitled to your opinion. I love SAO. Uh, I do feel like the games are so much better than the anime. I feel more connected to the characters. I feel like I've gotten to know the characters so much more through the games. They're so much more fleshed out and it's just awesome. Uh, I do like the anime because I felt more connected to the anime from playing the games, so. <laughs> but yeah, the anime has a lot of flaws, but I still like it.
Actually, the games of SAO coming out is what made me watch the anime. So many people don't believe me when I tell them this, but it is in commentary. The proof is there, okay? I saw the trailer for the very first game, Sword Art Online, Hollow Fragment, uh, for the PS Vita, and I was like, this looks amazing, and that's when I discovered there was an anime and there was manga for SAO, and that's when I decided to get the anime, and I loved it. Loved it. And because of that, I felt more connected to the characters in the game. After I played through Hollow Fragment, I rewatched the anime again and I felt even more connected and I just love SAO now. <laughs> love, love, love SAO. Quick, let's catch her. You can't run from me, girly. Right, friends. I've got so- oh, hang on. Companions. Got more info about Asuka now. Okay, Association Nemesis. In reality, she is an agent of the shadowy organization known as Nemesis, tasked with monitoring the Eclipse. She's been quietly stopping potential catastrophes. Dun dun dun! Shiori, a slightly shy, sweet girl with a strong spirit, Ko's next door neighbour and childhood friend, her and Ko's families are very close. Ryoto, one of Ko's closest friends, he devotes his life to slacking and chasing girls, almost the poster boy for the stereotypical lazy high school school student. I can't even talk anymore. Christ, I should take a drink. Oh, we did it, guys! 100 like hype! Thank you so much for the love and support on YouTube. We got that 100 like goal smashed. That is so awesome. Everyone, hashtag 100 like hype in the chat. Thank you so much. I'm going to go ahead and change the like goal as always. There's always two more like goals after the 100 likes. So the next goal is 120. And then the third and final goal is 150. But obviously the more likes the better on videos, guys. It really keeps the channel healthy and it helps to expose my videos to other people as well. Jun, another of Ko's close friends, his innocence, innocent appearance and easygoing personality makes him super popular with girls. Really? Is he? I'm not surprised. He is quite cute though. I like him. Log Horizon is awesome. I love Log Horizon. I do actually think Log Horizon is a lot better than the SAO anime. It goes into so much more detail about things and uh, more serious things as well. Toa, Ko's cousin and newly appointed homeroom teacher, miraculously gains the trust and respect of her students and fellow teachers from day one. It's that face. It's that face though. ladies yeah. oh Jackie <laughs> sorry oh it's you Aizawa Aizawa I have no idea if that's right You startled me! You literally ran into me. <laughs> I'm more startled than you. 
Fazex Fa T nine zero eighty eight. I'm just gonna call you Fazex for short. I still need to watch Log Horizon, but my list is packed. I know the feeling. It's not even a list for me anymore. It's a scroll. <laughs> it's that big. I go through peaks and troughs of wanting to watch uh, things on Netflix or things on Crunchyroll. I kind of like go through spurts of needing to watch anime or needing to read manga or needing to watch like live action series on Netflix. It just depends what mood I'm in really. <laughs> Am I going to get roped into going to the dojo? Skipping my work. Nicole says, never knew you were a live streamer. I've been enjoying a few of your JRPG playthroughs quite a bit though. I've found them pretty useful for determining if I should buy the game or not. Thank you so much, Brittany. That's awesome. I appreciate the support. Yes, I pretty much moved to streaming a couple of months ago. Uh, I've done it to help grow the channel because I spent a lot of money on changing my setup and because I love the live interaction with you guys, my team, GGK audience. So yeah, um, it's awesome live streaming. The fact that you guys can help me with puzzles and when I'm being an idiot. <laughs> Plus the live interaction answering questions. It's just so, so good. I love live streaming. My streaming schedule is up on my YouTube and Twitter banner, guys, by the way, if you don't know already. <laughs> and I've already set up the streams for next week for Axel World vs Sword Art Online, so make sure you check those out and set reminders. It's gonna be epic! Fazek says, do you like the Fate series, Kylie? I've not even watched any of the anime. Uh, I played one game, I think, and it was pretty interesting. Lots of sexy ladies. <laughs> but I can't really comment on it other than that. Not seen enough of it, to be honest. Greenfire says, hey everyone, just got home and had some food. Finally, I can relax. So how's life so far? We're enjoying this game, Greenfire. Vicky says, you are very good at live streaming because you do interact with your viewers. Oh, thank you, Vicky. It is quite hard on some games, like stuff like Freedom Wars. Obviously, I can't look over mid-mission because it's so action-packed and chaotic. But on games like this and uh, Ever Oasis, like... I can look over a lot and read out comments and talk to my viewers and it's so awesome being able to do that live. I feel like Ko is a dick. He just doesn't seem to care about anyone else at all. Ryan says there's way too many Fate animes. I don't. I wouldn't even know where to start, to be honest, with Fate. I know that some of it is on Crunchyroll, I think. I don't know if any of it is on Netflix, though. I've actually cancelled my Crunchyroll subscription because I wasn't watching it and it was just wasted money. So I've cancelled that for now. 
But I still have Netflix at the moment. Dave Doggy says, I'm absolutely convinced that they've ripped stuff straight out of Persona 4 Golden for this game. You're not the first person to say that, actually. It's probably true. <laughs> Sleemark says, it's fitting that you're playing this game. Your Cold Steel playthrough was my introduction to your channel. Oh, really? That's awesome, Sleemarks. Thank you for sticking by the channel for that long, then. Greatly appreciated, because that was quite a while ago. That I did this. Right, there's stuff. Hang on, don't I need to. Library. Someone told me to read books. Arjuna told me to read books. So the library is at the end, there we go, that's the sign. Ryan says, funny, she's the reason why I got into Cold Steel. Thanks, GGK. Oh, thank you so much, Ryan. New books will arrive regularly at the library. Select the shelf to have a read. Chris, if you're watching this, I said regularly, only because it's written in front of me. <laughs> I always say regular, not regularly. It drives him mad. Reading these books will increase specific stats for Co, so checking back often is recommended. Books that have been read will be registered to the book tab on the R so that they can be reread at will. Read the books at will! Right, so basically just go to the shiny bits. Like in Cold Steel. A new book has arrived. Read Culture and History of Miri Mia? Mori Mori Mia even. No. Yeah, Mori Mia. Oh god knows. Culture and History of Mori Mia. Mori Mia is one of the major suburbs located on the outskirts of Tokyo, originally called Musashi no Kuni. I'm butchering these names, I'm so sorry. It was once the site of a military garrison. There were also a great number of sacred groves, which eventually gave the city its name. As the city modernised and expanded, the groves were cut down and only remnants of them remain in the Kamiyama district in the northeast section of the city. In the Great War, 70 years ago, Mori Mia city was the target of several air raids but escaped relatively unscathed which led to refugees relocating there after the war. It was these historical developments that shaped the current day Morimiya city, making it one of the bigger Tokyo satellite cities, I think. The current population is 400,000 people, people <clears throat> excuse me, there is a commercial district with a large-scale mall, retro shopping arcades, and even several shopping streets dating back to the Meiji period. The city's downtown area is home to government and corporate offices. I need a drink. God damn it, this is a lot of text. The Tokyo disaster that occurred 10 years ago caused an immense amount of damage but the combined effort of the local government and the Hokuto group allowed Morimiya to quickly recover, even building the landmark Arcus Tower, a powerful transmission tower, within a mere three years. Morimiya is serviced by several transportation companies such as NR, JNR, Kyubi Line and the Tamna, Tama Monorail. In the northwest part of the city is the Morimiya 
Memorial Park, the National Defence Force, also has disaster response forces stationed in the vicinity. The northeast is home to the Kamiyama district, famous for its hot springs, combining urban convenience and modern living with natural beauty and a sense of tradition. Morimiya City is a bustling centre of both commerce and leisure. Christ, that's a lot of text. I read it though. Ko's wisdom increased. Culture and history of Morimiya has been registered. Is there any more books upstairs maybe? Or is it just one? I wonder how often new books arrive then. You don't do karate without being into it. She's hot. She's hot. Sensei is hot. Two years <laughs> Don't forget guys, every single like helps to support the stream, so click the thumbs up button if you haven't done so already. It really helps me out guys. Thank you so much for supporting. Ko explains that he has an acquaintance of... was an acquaintance of Sora's. I did spar with her recently though. She had me on the back foot the entire time. <laughs> Long story short, she's a badass. Haha, <laughs> you can tell, huh? Domi Gamer says, is she a new potential waifu? Uh, no. No, not for me, anyway. She's hot, but she's not like top tier hot. <laughs> oh dear, Stern, Stern telling off. Ryan says I'd let her beat me up any day. <laughs> Use them fists on me, girl. I'll catch Sora another time. Yeah, no, now's not a good time. <laughs> it's awkward. Do 
So I only had time to do one thing, basically. Extra Onion says, have no fear, the source of vitamins is here. Da -da -da -da! Onions to the rescue. Hello, young man. Do you have a moment? Yes, there's something I want you to do before your shift today. I put up a request request addressed to your to you on the R. Please have a look at it. Haha, <laughs> this method is surer. We wouldn't want the particulars forgotten now, would we? Anyway, it's quite simple. Please take care of it. I want to see you Yukino. I love Yukino. Yukino is like top tier waifu at the moment. I've chosen a waifu. The quest tab on Neol can now be used. The quest tab contains various requests posted on the forum in Neol. Neol can be opened by pressing down on the D-pad to check out the requests on the quest tab. So we've got two here. Caffeinating my third eye. <laughs> what? <laughs> I need a favour from you. Go to Sakura Pharmacy in Station Square and fetch the special pick me up from Mizuhara, the pharmacist there. I've already told him you're coming. And then we've got this one, which is I dropped my precious wallet. I dropped my precious, precious wallet somewhere and now I can't find it. I'm in the first floor hallway at school. Someone please help me. So, do I accept it or what? Like, I can't do anything with it, so I don't think I need to do anything? I don't know. About quests. The forum on Nier sometimes has requests or questions from people who post on there. These kinds of posts will be logged on quests on your Nier quest tab main mainly during the free time. Aside from quests marked required, you are free to accept or ignore requests. Some may expire if you progress the story, however, so be careful. Depending on the timing, there are some hidden quests that are not registered on Nier. During free time, you can receive quests on Nier. Okay, so a quest has been added, will be indicated in green. Talk to clients with the green exclamation mark overhead to start a quest. Cool. Well guys, I am desperate for the toilet, so I'm going to go ahead and nip to the loo. Now, don't forget, you can take part in the mini game that we always do when I nip out. Gadget Chair Blue, hungry for souls. What you need to do is not blink from the moment I leave till the moment I return. If you do, he gets your soul. If you lost it last time, this is your chance to win it back. Let me know when I return. If you won or lost, I'll be back in a second.
どうすっかなどうやって勝つのかなガジチェアブルー is getting some souls tonight. Nom nom nom. Nom nom nom. Ryan says I lost very easily. Extra Onion says Gadget Chair Blue is rocking this stream. All the emotions, the gaming prowess. Gadget Chair Blue should definitely get a raise. You can help feed in. You can help feed in by. Joining my Patreon for three dollars a month, and by losing the game, he will eat your soul and be satisfied. <laughs> Jane Kingy says, "I won. Congratulations." Wasn't there a quest like this very early on in Trails of Cold Steel as well? Oh really? <laughs> Pushing Gamer says I had to blink. Greenfire says I won, I pretended he wasn't there. Somebody's watching me! Maybe she fancies me. I will help you find more than your wallet, just saying. Just saying. Really? You're my hero! Arjuna says Gadget Chair Blue is actually Magusa. <laughs> yeah. Right, so might be on the roof. JM Kingy says, why does Ko look constantly annoyed with everyone? It's like I said, he, he doesn't really care about other people. That's kind of the vibe I'm getting from him right now. So he's kind of like, everyone's a chore. <laughs> Stop talking to me. I don't care about you. That's his attitude.
Started quest, precious wallet. Actually, I can just um, fast travel to the roof, can't I? There we go. Well, I don't see anything on the ground here. Oh! There we go. That's it, isn't it? Something else here. A piece of paper. A photo! I want to know what's on the picture! <laughs> oh, I'm curious. Oh! quest seems so familiar. There wasn't a quest exactly the same in Trails of Cold Steel, was there? She's in love! Lady on lady action! I approve! And we're together again! Rub rub rub! Where is she rubbing that picture? Do I want to know? Mikey says I hate fetch quests. RPG games are filled with fetch quests all the time, aren't they? Extra Onion says double stream for the win! Yes! I'm actually a Twitch affiliate now, guys, so if you do have a Prime sub available, an Amazon Prime sub, and you haven't used it on anyone yet, maybe consider subscribing to me and helping me out. Because you can sub to me on Twitch now, and you can also send me cheers. But obviously the best way to support the channel and to donate is through firstly stream tip, secondly Patreon, and then through Twitch, because Twitch actually take 50%. Uh, so yeah, I think I've got four people subscribed to me using their subs on uh, Twitch at the moment, but Twitch is taking 50% of that. I thought YouTube was bad taking 45%, but uh, Twitch take 50%. We'll become sworn sisters forever! She's creepy. She's like a super, super fan, isn't she? Completed the quest, Precious Wallet. Obtained 200 gems. Ko's virtue increased. So I got a gem as well, guys. I'm guessing this will be explained later on. Friend page has been updated. We actually haven't read through all of this. <laughs> right, let's let's read through. We've gone through com companions already, so let's go through first year students. So Sora, a gifted martial artist whose father is a master of the Ikushima style, always polite and well mannered, she rarely, if ever, lets her guard down around others. Ayumi, a somewhat reserved sophomore with a naturally motherly nature, she joins the culinary, culinary, I can't, I always struggle with that, culinary club because of her love of making pastries and sweets. She looks cute, I like her. Takashi, 
A sophomore with a perpetually optimistic outlook who is serious about club acti activities, he loves running and devotes all his time to the track and field club. Arjuna says you can exchange gems for yen, Kylie. Is that the only um, the only use for them? I've totally lost the ability to speak then. Haruhiko, an indifferent student with dyed hair, seems to be devoted to becoming a shiftless layabout and street thug, but question mark. See, this is the guy we spoke to and he was like, don't mess with me, I have orange hair in part one. Weirdo. He's a creep, he's a weirdo. No doka. A student who truly appreciates and admires the female form, she fell for the student council president after her speech at the school's opening ceremony. Her most prized possession is, is a picture of the student council president, Mitsuki Hokuto, which she keeps in her wallet at all times. My precious! Ayato. A member of the cheer squad marked by his diminu diminutive size. I am so dyslexic. Like, I've said, me and Chris have talked about this so much. I think I do struggle. Like, I think I have some form of reading dyslexia. I was never tested for it, but I do struggle with certain words. And I do mix up my words as well, so I do apologise. I am trying my best. Size an ever-present headband, he joined the squad in order to become stronger and more confident. Chiaki, she is a junior with a vibrant, outgoing personality. She is also one of the strongest members of the karate club. Nice. Nobu, god he's big isn't he? Big and burly. A chubby gourmand who truly appreciates the art of eating, he is also surprisingly well connected as his personality makes it easy for people to relate to him. Hekiru, I think? A super outgoing president of the journalism club, she is always on the lookout for a scoop and is terrifyingly fast at reporting breaking news. Hayato, a serious focused young man, he is in the swim, swim club with Yuji who has been his fiercest rival since they first joined the club. JM Kingy says, don't let it get to you Kylie, we all have things that we have trouble with. It's fine, it doesn't get to me. At the end of the day, like, reading, reading helps, doesn't it? So I'm not gonna just not read because I struggle with certain words. Another, another member of the swim club, although much more easygoing than Hayato, his rivalry with his teammate is deadly serious. He's hot. Yuji is hot. Okay, let's have a look at Hayato again. No, Yuji. Look at that smile. Look at that hair. Look at that pose. I'm liking him. I am liking him. Karen. Oh, Karen's cute. Blonde hair, blue eyes. A half Japanese, half American student with blonde hair and blue eyes, despite her limited Japanese, her personality makes it easy for her to make friends. Chizuru, head of class D and Ryoto's childhood friend, Ryoto's childhood friend even, and Minder. She lives above the confectionery located in the main shopping area. My Maya, I think that's how you say that. A third year female student and captain of the karate club, talented and takes care of others, she is adored by her club mates. Masa Masataka, head of the discipline committee, a firm believer in the power of rules and regulations, he endlessly lectures those who break even the most trivial of rules. Oh, he's a stiff. He's a stiff. <laughs> JM Kingy says Karen is possibly best waifu. Karen is definitely pretty. I like her. Kosaka. 
The passionate president of the Film Studies Club, he does his best despite not getting enough funding and manpower for the club. Erika! Ooh, I like her hair! A senior with a domineering personality, the daughter of a wealthy family, she sees student council president Hokuta as her finest, fiercest, fiercest rival even. Teachers. Goro, incredibly handsome and therefore incredibly popular with female students, he teaches his classes with a subtle, much appreciated sense of humour. Dave Doggy says, Chizuru may look like a bookworm, wallflower, but I bet she is a fiery vixen. Yeah. <laughs> Mr. Shi Shiokawa, the soon to be retiring vice principal, forever fretting about the reputation of the school, his worries never seem to end. Tanabe, I think, the intensely driven Japanese teacher with a terrifying passion for his subject, always has his students' best interests in mind, though his efforts are for naught. <laughs> He's always a failure. The PE teacher Saki, okay, with a sister sisterly disposition and the soul of a drill sergeant, her classes are feared as Spartan-like death marches, as is her past as a delinquent. Oh, she's a badass. I like her, actually. She's quite hot. Hello, octopus. Welcome to the stream. Tentacles! Anyway, maintenance supporters. Sasuke, Ko's maternal grandfather and caretaker of the Ko Koko no Kokonoe shrine, a master of the Kokonoe Ikushima style of martial arts, very few can stand against him. Yukino, Yukino is waifu! I love Yukino so much. A woman with seemingly endless connections who finds Ko various part-time jobs. She comes across as both incredibly lazy and mind-bendingly weird. <laughs> I love her so much. <laughs> Old man Yam Yamaoka. The proprietor of a popular Brick Alley cafe, his success comes from both the relaxed vibe of his shop and the excellence of his coffee. Look at the picture, he's like, look at my coffee. I serve the best coffee in the world. Greenfire says, don't worry about it, Kylie. I mix my words up sometimes. Let's say my brain works faster than I realise. Plus, I do mix my languages up occasionally, especially when I'm spelling at times. See, I'm not the only one. Yama or Ku Kugayama? God knows. God only knows if I'm saying these names correctly. Oh, she dropped some kind of card. めんどくせえな。Handed over the card. Card. 
when you kind of just ran away. What would you save, dear then? Now you owe us, girl. Give me your number. Nice breast close up there. <laughs> oh, bacon. I could just eat a bacon sandwich right now. That's not the kind of thanks that I was looking for, lady. Okay. Ko just doesn't even care, like he... Does he have a willy? <laughs> Maybe he likes guys, I don't know, but... He just isn't interested in the ladies whatsoever. Eh? Ernest says nice pink hair, yes. Hold it right there! What do you mean, Pass? I recognise this voice. I recognise the VA. Ernest says rise from Persona 4. <laughs> really? So not only do we have characters that look like SAO characters, but we also have a character that looks like Persona character. I'm an up and coming member of Spiker! Rion, that's my autograph you're turning your nose up at. <laughs> I think I've heard of you. You think you've heard it mentioned once or twice? Kind of a bit full of herself, really, isn't she? Parasite says Ko just needs to find a woman who will dominate him like Yukino. Mikey says, let me take his spot in this game if he doesn't care about the waifus. <laughs> All the waifus will be Mikey's. She's just collapsed in despair. I think now she's just going to be more determined than ever to get him to like her. That old chestnut. You're right, I've got to get to the agency. But first, what's your name? Just give me your name! <laughs> I remember that. Rion handed over a piece of music media. Listen to my CD, I like it! <laughs> this is Spiker's single that just came out. Listen to it, you won't regret it. You will like my tunes! She's kind of bossy, isn't she? Faye Merv says, Ko is kind of like me. I know the existence of popular music groups, but I don't really listen to anything by those groups. See, I like certain bands and stuff, but I don't like, I don't get obsessed about the members. I don't, mostly don't even know their names, um, you know, or their eye colour and what their favourite food is. Can't be asked with all that crap. I've never been interested in it. I just like a band and I just like the music. I don't need to know what their weight is and their, what their allergies are and all that rubbish. Can't be asked. and not interested. I like what I like.
I wouldn't say she was stuck up, but I do think she was a bit full of herself, expecting everyone to know her and like someone should be so grateful to receive her autograph. Hey, Lady Mew Mew, welcome to the stream. Good to see you in the stream, actually. It's been a while. Rory Mia City is now available. Complete the, re the request caffeinating my third eye and then head to the sports equipment store at the shopping street to progress the main story. Ooh, I don't know what that is. Affinity shards have been added. Regarding affinity shards and friendship episodes. During free time periods, you can complete quests and friendship episodes for some of your friends or sub-characters. By using affinity shards, you can view certain events and also deepen your friendship with that character. This is so like Trails of Cold Steel. Parasite says the VA doesn't seem to be like anything I've seen you play on your channel. It might be from an anime, maybe. That that girl's voice. Once free time is over, however, friendship episodes will disappear like quests, so be careful. Using an affinity shard obtained during free time will allow you to watch a friendship episode with a character. Characters with the yellow exclamation mark will have friendship episodes available. Okay. Kazuto says, Kylie, you got a laid back hairstyle today. It's because, right, my skin is being annoying today. It's one of those days where my skin is being super sensitive and any hair is making me itch. I have really temperamental skin, so that's why I've kind of got it back today out of the way so that it's not annoying. Friendship page has been updated. Who's been updated? Rion, a famous idol that comes across as incredibly flirtatious in public and on TV. In rea reality, she's actually very down to earth and easygoing. Okay, Rion is pretty hot though. <laughs> There's so many waifus. So many waifus. What does one do with so many waifus? Lady Mew Mew says, I can't wait to get this game. When are you getting it? It's out now, by the way. It's out now on uh, the American store and the EU store. I need another drink, man. Right, so what do I want to do now? Sakura Pharmacy. Oh yeah, that's the quest, isn't it? Right, I've got about 10 minutes left, so maybe do this quest and then uh, call it. Parasite says, answer to that question of what do you do with too many waifus, start a harem. <laughs> Faye says, does this game have too many waifus? Have we actually found a game with too many waifus? <laughs> Zachariah says, I just watched some gameplay for Mary Skelter and it looks awesome. I don't know anything about it, but it looks awesome. Are you going to play it when it comes out? I would like to play it, yes. Um, I don't know. I don't know if I'm 
gonna get a review code or if I will use my PlayAsia partnership credit. Don't forget guys, to maintain my PlayAsia partnership monthly credit, I do need to make sales. You can actually buy physical games, digital PSN points, Microsoft points, eShop points, all through my affiliate link in the video description. As long as you go through that link and you buy things, it actually gives my channel a small commission, it helps to maintain my monthly sales, and it means I can keep getting the PlayAsia partnership credit. Actually, the reason I was able to get this game was because I used my PlayAsia partnership credit. If I didn't have that credit, I would not have bought this and I would not be streaming it right now. So obviously making purchases through my PlayAsia link is a massive help for the channel, guys. And like I said, you can get PSN points, you can get Microsoft points, anime figures, physical games, digital games, Steam codes, all in different currencies. As long as you go through that link, it really supports the channel, guys. So thank you to every single person doing that. This shampoo is 668 yen. You can have a snack as a reward. That was his plan all along. Look at him, he's devious. He's like, yes, my plan worked. Oh god, really? So we're doing a job now, but she's making us do more work as well. <laughs> Nightbot is a bot program. I can set it up to post certain things at certain times or certain intervals. And also my mods can use it to post certain things as well. So it's there to just help promote stuff like PlayAsia, like my Patreon, Stream Tip, um, and all sorts of other things. And also mods can use some commands. It also helps filter out some hate. I can block certain words that I don't allow on my stream and stuff like that. So it's basically an extra mod, but it's not as good as a human mod. <laughs> There's certain things it can do which lightens the load for my real human mods. How long has she been active, says Carrie. I have been streaming since around half eight and it's now five to 11. So yeah, you're right at the end of the stream, literally. Oh God, he knows about the eclipse. Who are you? Carrie, if you want to stay up to date with my streams, then I do recommend looking at my YouTube and Twitter banner because my schedule is actually up on there. But sometimes I do stream outside of the schedule as well, but all of those do get tweeted about on my Twitter. You don't need a Twitter account to view those tweets, so I do recommend bookmarking my Twitter page or following me on there and then that way you can stay in the loop about when I'm going live, any streams outside of the schedule and also I tweet about my streams in advance so you can actually click on the links and set reminders. So that's probably the best thing to do because YouTube is pretty finicky at the moment and I know it's not notifying a lot of my subscribers so it's a really good idea to be following me on Twitter or viewing my public tweets.
Greetings from Poland. Hello, uh, Michio. And Dark and Sang says you are cool, girl. Thank you. Fair enough. So basically he's the doctor, in case we get uh, beaten up in the eclipse. <laughs> Don't forget to hit the thumbs up button guys, it shows me you're enjoying the stream and you want more of this game. It is direct support for the channel, it keeps the channel healthy, so don't forget to click it. And of course, views, comments, favourite shares and donations also help to show me that you are having a good time and you do want more of this game. Exchange your gems for yen with me. So this is what Arjuna was talking about earlier. Which time zone is the stream based off? I am a UK streamer, so it is BST at the moment. But I've also put the uh, time zone in American time as well on the banner. You can find a time converter online. Quest caffeinating my third eye has begun. You can now buy Eclipse medicines and exchange gems at Sakura Pharmacy. Talk to Mizuhara and select buy and then go to exchange to exchange gems for yen. Gems you pick up can be converted into money at certain stores. Gems may be offered as quest rewards on Nyar. Yeah, you got shake. There we go. Buy, what can I get? Glorious! <laughs> What's this? Recovers 500 HP. A nutritious drink made for those reaching for tomorrow's glory today. <laughs> okay. I don't even know how, how much HP. Oh, there we go. So, 771 and 553. Let's get like, I don't know, four of these or something? And then that'll do. JM Kingy says, Kylie, who why does every Japanese game have such amazing music? They're just good at it. They're good at the background music. Oh god, here we go. Obtained fat stack of cash. Fat stack of cash, guys. <laughs> Eclipse raw materials. Star camera next door and the materials to Kuguraya in the shopping street. Be sure to mention my name so they know what's going on. I'm counting on you. Oh, 
we did it guys! Whoop whoop! 120 like hype! Thank you so much for the like support on this video and stream, it's greatly appreciated really helps the channel, helps to expose my videos and bring in new team GGK members, plus it keeps the channel healthy. So thank you so much for clicking that like button guys. Everyone hashtag 120 like hype in the stream chat. That is awesome. Thank you so much. I'm not going to put the next goal on because um, I actually need to stop the stream literally in a minute as soon as I'm able to because it's 11 o'clock at night and I can't stream past 11. Other people go to bed. Right, let's save and this is the end of the stream guys. So thank you so much for joining me. I've had a fantastic time talking to you all, as always, you've been awesome. Not only did we smash the first goal of 100 likes, but we smashed the 120 like goal as well, guys, which is epic. So thank you so much for that support. If you haven't done so already, subscribe and join Team GGK today. I stream regular and I put out regular content as well, so make sure you sub and you can stay in the loop with my content. If you do sub, tick the box after clicking the bell to turn on notifications and also don't forget guys YouTube is a bit temperamental it might not notify you about everything so pay attention to my YouTube and Twitter banner for my streaming schedule and also follow me on Twitter or at the very least view my public tweets because I do tweet about my streams in advance and sometimes I stream outside of my schedule that's on my YouTube and Twitter banner also guys, don't forget Adpocalypse is still very real, it's still very serious, lots of content creators are struggling, this is why I have a stream tip goal and a Patreon goal as well, you can support me on both of those if you wish to contribute financially, I have rewards and benefits on Patreon like Discord, insider information, exclusive Patreon monthly giveaways, birthday cards, videos, stuff like that. There's all sorts of rewards on Patreon or alternatively you can just send a one-off donation through my stream tip. But anyway, anyway guys, thank you so much. Take it easy and I don't know what I'm streaming tomorrow. I'm gonna see what kind of support this gets. I might do a third part, I don't know. It all depends on views, likes, comments, donations and all that kind of stuff. Um, but yeah, I don't know what I'm streaming tomorrow. I'll tweet about it in the morning. Anyway, thank you for watching. Take it easy and I shall see you next time, guys.